welcome to the Business Show 2021 at the XL Arena. I'm here with Kevin from Boom and Partners. And uh, Kevin, for those that don't know Boom and Partners, uh, what exactly is it that you do? Yeah, well, we're a business consultancy and we work with early stage businesses. Everybody from uh, I've got a good idea and I wish to set up a business but I don't know how to go about it through to those businesses that have scaled more and are looking to raise maybe 10 million pounds. So we help them to understand what they need to do, when they need to do it, how to go about it, and we can help them do that. We help them understand the strategy, and much of what we do is also focused around raising finance, because any business that's looking to scale will almost never have to raise finance in one way or another. And do you find that there's certain types of sectors or types of businesses that are like require your services, are we talking sort of tech, or it could be anything? It can be anything, but the ones that need to raise larger amounts of money more quickly tends to be tech in one form or another because it is a lot of it is about land grab. If they don't roll their product out and grab that particular sector, particularly if it's something really quite innovative, then somebody else might. Uh, if you're scaling a, a, a coffee shop or a chain of coffee shops, obviously timing is not so critical. But we work with, with businesses from many, many different sectors. And, and you've been in business for some time now, you've actually got your own book here. Yep. And so what, tell us a bit more about your background. Uh, I used to work for international banks in the City of London as an analyst and then uh, in business development. Been running a business consultancy since 1996 and we've worked with hundreds of businesses. I personally am a business mentor for uh, the UK's largest entrepreneur accelerator, the Prince's Trust and a, a mentor and a guest lecturer for Bayes Business School. So we see people coming through those channels and as a business uh, we work with all of the, those sort of companies that I mentioned earlier. And the book came about because I also write a lot of published articles and so many people were saying, why don't you put all of this together in one place? So I wrote the book. And that does take you through that whole journey from how do I set up a business all the way through those steps that I was mentioning earlier. So there's a bit of it, kind of like your life's work here in, in, a, in a book here? I well, mean, not so much? Well, yeah, so actually, many people have asked me, how long did it take you to write the book? And I'd rather glibly answered 40 years, because it's based on 40 years of experience. Actually putting pen to paper, as it were, was, was not 40 years, but yeah, absolutely, it is, it is entirely based on all of that hundreds of times I get asked the same questions and many of those questions it really doesn't matter what sector it's about it's the same sort of how do we do this and so it might be technical things like uh, SEIS or EIS advanced assurance or R&D tax credits or more technical and it might simply be how do we go about doing something or how, how do we uh, scale our business, should we have an advisory board, those sorts of more generic questions. And do you find that the, the fundamentals remain the same across those 40 years and it's only maybe things like you know trends and technology that change or do you find yourself having to adapt the way that you advise people? What was interesting uh, during the pandemic and lockdown, we were inundated with businesses saying, help, how do I save my business? And it was all about adapting and pivoting, and that was very much the focus. It's now very much about growth. And what you find in any period of rapid change is it brings up so many more opportunities. And it's the early stage business, the, the entrepreneurs that are so much better able to understand and see those opportunities and then to grab them and do something with them. Because larger, more established businesses seem to be much slower in their, their thinking and their, their adapting. But what's really interesting for me is the new business model that's come out of that is people have kept the bits that they've adapted or pivoted in and they've also gone back to doing what they were doing yeah, before. Sure. So their new business model is, is a, a combination of the two, and so they've got more income streams and it's just working better for them. Okay, and if someone's watching this now, and, and they've got you know they've got a great product, they know their business inside now, but they're looking to grow, and there's certain areas of expertise that they're not quite sure of. Um, what would you suggest to them? How would they contact you, and uh, do you have like free consultation? What's the process? 
Yeah, so we, we because of the, the, the wide range of businesses we work with, the only real way it works is to have an initial conversation with them. So we would typically have 45 minutes, an hour, Zoom call, meeting over coffee, whatever it happens to be, so that we can better understand the business and what they need and how we can help them. We can then work out on that, how much time that looks like. We always really look for a long-term relationship so that we can grow with that business. And then we have clients that are on three, four hours a month retainers and others that are on four or five days a month retainer. And we are also quite often asked to join or indeed to establish an advisory board because certainly if a business is looking at raising finance, you need a good advisory board. And a good advisory board should plug the holes around the, the founders in the knowledge and experience and contacts that they themselves don't have. And, and so that's what we do. And we uh, are available through the website or LinkedIn or uh, our details if, if you buy a copy of the book. Whilst I, as an individual, have written the book, there is also details in the book uh, by way of a card with the business details and such things as well. Okay, fantastic. Well, I'm sure there's a huge amount of people out there that you can help. You've got a wealth of experience and also your colleagues that you, you work with. Um, so obviously it's, it's a bit of a no-brainer that people should get in touch, have a free sort of 45 minutes consultation, understand where you are and whether or not you can help. Obviously it sounds like they're very flexible, whether it's four yep, hours or yep. four days a month. Um, so I suggest everybody should get in touch with Kevin and the Boomin Partners uh, in, in the near coming future. So I appreciate your time, Kevin. Thank you, Pleasure. Thank you.